So this is the continuation for October 31st, 2021. I had just taken out more pasta from the, the oven. I was about to say stove, but it's the, there's a difference. I'm um, taking out more vegan Parmesan that smells like, I like to repeat, stinky feet. That would not be considered offensive. It wouldn't. Think of the the fruit durian. There's a fruit that's called durian. It's a bit of a spiky, large melon-shaped fruit that just happens to smell like stinky feet, and people describe it as that. Doesn't matter whether or not it's naturally occurring. Or otherwise synthetic or semi synthetic. Take out all the moisture from this bag. And all the air so the moisture collects. What it gets on my clothing just happens that my shirt smells like vegan parmesan. Put the bag in the fridge. Sealed as possible. Yeah. Oh, some air got caught in here. So I have, I have more in here, just like brothels in Sicily, you know, just like they had delivered wheels of Parmesan to banks in 2009. It's a bit questionable that they're using it as a form of currency there. How they connect the two with people who work at banks, you know what I'm saying? I guess they thought that's where the money was flowing, huh? Okie dokie, enough of me. Ay, 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 ay. I took the pillowcase off my pillow here. I like it better without the pillowcase, actually. You know, I wouldn't mind if it smelled like unicorn girls stinky. Well, if she had her feet and if they were deliberately stinky for me on the pillow, I wouldn't mind it. You know, I know that there are people that are hyper-religious, but it's, they call them. It would be a form of christening if you think of it that way. It's a little DNA. Dun, 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 dun. Some type of evidence, you know what I'm saying? It's really good still. My memory works strange sometimes. Like today, I'm able to remember that the other day when I was rewatching the recording for how I described how I was making the tomato sauce as usual. I'm thinking, you know, they can maybe, you know, search for the people could just like look through my videos on Facebook or whatever and then eventually find the how I assembled the recipe instead of me just listing the ingredients verbatimly verbally. And I had remembered just now that while watching or rewatching the video from two nights ago, reviewing it, that I forgot to mention in that video, the coarsely ground Himalayan pink salt, I believe. I used about 10 rotations in there. I 
There's probably something else that I may have mentioned. I may have forgotten to mention, too. Still warm. I also have these. Oh, hold on. Oh, my God. My, my mother had purchased uh, two bags of this. Sometimes they do eat meatless products. They're the Morningstar Farms Veggie Grillers Crumbles, okay? Some of their products do contain egg whites and dairy, but the Grillers Veggie Burgers, they're veggie burgers that are uh, labeled as Grillers, the plain ones. They, have, they make a vegan one that has no eggs and no dairy. And this looks like it says it only contains soy and wheat ingredients for the crumble.